What is going on good people of YouTube? It's me Chavez and in today's video we'll be breaking open this box of 2021-2022 Panini Revolution basketball. So if you can dig that, be sure to stick around, like, subscribe, click the notification icon because it all means a ton. And with that being said, let's have a little fun. What is going on everybody? Thank you so much for stopping by the channel and joining me today for this video. Today we are going to be ripping open this 2021-2022 box of Panini Revolution basketball. We have eight packs with five cards in each pack. Looking for four rookies, four inserts, eight parallels, and um, here are a couple of things that we can also be on the lookout for, ranging from autographs to the ultra rare galactic parallel. So full transparency, this is the very first time I've opened this product. Um, I picked this up from my local card shop. I actually won a contest a or a monthly drawing for uh, $50 off my next purchase. So I was contemplating, do I want to go in there and like penny pinch and try to get bang for my buck and, you know, use $50, you know, on a few different things? Or do I want to just put that towards uh, a product that, um, you know, that I've never pulled before and, you know, trying to kind of do something new. So I decided to put that $50 towards this box of revolution. So yeah, the box was a little bit more than $50, but nonetheless, I'm hoping we can uh, pull some cool things from here. Like I said, like I always say, when I break boxes, I'm really looking to, you know, do a couple of things, build the PC and, you know, possibly pull something that is uh, worth getting graded to increase the value. So thanks again for stopping by the channel. If you haven't done so already, please be sure to drop a like, subscribe, click the notification icon. It means a lot to me. All right. One thing I'm going to be more conscious of in this video is keeping the cards in frame. I noticed that last video, I was kind of holding the cards like over here. And then when uh, I looked down at the at the uh, the camera, I could see that the card wasn't in frame. So sorry about that. I'm gonna make sure that I do not do that as often in this video. Also, if you notice all the uh, uh, scrapings on my arm, that's due to uh, having a new dog. So I, I recently uh, recently got a new puppy and she is awesome. She is great, um, but she is a handful. And one of the things she likes to do is bite me and it's due to the teething phase. So any puppy owners out there, or new new puppy owners out there, that is part of the whole process and just been a, uh, a learning experience for her and I. So it's getting better though. She hasn't sank her fangs into me in, in a while, but uh, I'm not gonna lie. The first couple times she did it, did not feel good. Now she's just at the point where she's just kind of nibbling and mouthing, which it's, it doesn't hurt as much, and I'm trying to get her in the habit of learning when too much, when, when it's too much, basically. So, um, enough about my puppy. Maybe I'll put a picture up or a quick video up on this channel. But uh, here we are. We have our, we have our, we have our three, four, five, six, seven, eight packs of cards. Five cards per pack. We're looking for rookies. We're looking for galactic parallels. So let's just get to it and open this, open the, up these packs. Hope everyone is doing really well today. I'm, uh, I'm shooting this video on a Monday. So typically Mondays are like not everybody's favorite day. Um, it's just a day, you know, you make, you make of it. You make the day, you know, what you want to make the day, you know? So if you come into the day with, with, a, with a bad attitude or just with a bad, you know, outlook, then it's going to be a bad day. So. I, I like to go into my days with a positive attitude. Nothing too obnoxious, but just, you know, something, you know, something, you know, a little positive on the mind. Always works better for me than having some negativity on the mind. All right, here we go. Starting off with a Jeremy Grant. 
So again, these are my, this is my first time seeing these cards, man. These are really nice cards. Um, I love the look of these. And I know they're really glittery and shiny, but they're smooth, so there's no flaking or, you know how glitter falls off of things. And then, like if you're at a birthday party or somebody gives you a gift and the gift bag or the wrapping paper has a lot of glitter and then that glitter gets all over your clothes. So <laughs> it's kind of annoying. Uh, these cards do not have that problem. You have a Derek White, we have an RJ Barrett, a Carmelo, An Carmelo Anthony, and our first rookie is of Jeremiah Robinson Earl. So, nothing, nothing too crazy with that pack. Going on to pack number two. All right. Turning these over. Starting off with a De'Aaron Fox. What a rough year he had, man. Um, what a rough, actually, hold on. Let me go back to this Carmelo. This looks like a different Carmelo. So this is a groove. Okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. Let me let me back up real quick. So look, these are just sorry. These are just a uh, like your typical base cards, but Revolution has the groove, much like the Prism logo that you see on the back of certain cards. So this is not just a typical base card. So that's kind of cool. All right. Look, we're learning. We're learning together. All right, here we go. De'Aaron Fox. What a rough year he had, right? Man. Uh, Gary Trent Jr. Nice. We have our, looks like our first mem or auto card, and it is of Trey Man. Okay. Not hating that, not hating that. Flipping this over, we have a Christian Wood anniversary. And then ending it with a LeBron James Supernova. Nice. Those are pretty nice cards. I'm not going to lie. Um, first time seeing these. So I'm getting, you know, um, I'm getting used to, you know, what some of these, uh, well, not that one, actually. Well, getting used to some of these parallels. Like you have your anniversary parallel and you have your groove parallel. So that's pretty cool. I like that. And we have an auto and it's of Trey Man. Yeah. Nice. Nice. All right. Moving on. Pack number three. I said this in my previous video where I kind of want to get out of purchasing uh, retail with a lot of packs and a lot of cards because you know it just ends up with you just end up with an overwhelming amount of base cards and it's hard to find uses for those things right i mean they just pile up so i wanted to start start shifting my my focuses towards products that don't have as many cars but the cars that they do have are a little higher quality so i think revolution fits that hopefully we can pull some some more cool cars we've pulled a few cool ones already so jaron jackson Rudy Gobert, we have a Kawhi Leonard coming up on uh, another parallel. This is of Jalen Johnson. It is a groove parallel. Nice. All right. And then ending it with a Charles Bassey rookie looks to be a base. All right. Moving in to pack number four. So nothing too crazy yet. I mean, the autograph is nice, but it's a Trey man. It's not a, um, you know, not of a, a higher, you know, a more popular rookie like Mobley or, um, you know, Jalen Green or someone. So, all right, starting off with a Clint Capella. We have a Harrison Barnes and Anthony Davis. This is going into a Groove Parallel. No, Astro Parallel of Chris Paul. And ending it with a Jalen Green Shockwave. That is nice. That is really nice. Yeah. And this is a this is a rookie card, but I don't see the rookie logo on it anywhere. So I wonder if that would hurt the value of this card. I hope not. But that is a cool card. I'm just gonna put that over here. 
All right. Sorry that it's out of frame. I've been working with different angles on my videos, trying to just get the, the top view down. Um, still working with it. Still working on it. All right, we have a Zion Williamson. We have a Lou Dort, Tyler Hero, going into a vortex of Kyrie Irving. Irving, excuse me, a fractal. So this parallel is a fractal parallel. Dude, I gotta get used to these names, man. These are some pretty cool guards. And then a Bones Highland. Nice, rookie, very nice. Um, you know, working with these angles, the cameras, the lightings, it's so much that goes into creating the content. So much, much respect and um, love to everybody who's putting out content. It's not as easy as people make it look, that's for sure. All right, going into our six pack, we have a Andrew Wiggins. We have a Nikola Vucevic. We have a Carl Anthony Towns. A Cade Cunningham rookie, and is this a parallel? It is a fractal, very nice. And then ending it with a vortex of Evan Mobley. Man, okay, now we're cooking. Now, we got the first three picks in this draft class. Jalen Green, excuse me, Cade Cunningham, Jalen Green, and Evan Mobley. Nice, very nice. I'm, I'm kind of liking Revolution right now, that's for sure. All right. Seventh pack, we have a Bradley Beal, another guy who had just had like a rough year. Darius Baisley, Derek Rose. We have a rookie card of Jalen, or excuse me, Jaden Springer, and that is an Astro. And then another Evan Mobley. And this is a, just looks like a base rookie card of Evan Mobley. Wow. All right. Very cool. All right. Ugh. Can we get one of those galactic parallels that that is uh, being advertised on this box? That'd be nice to end the, end the video with that. All right, last pack, eighth and final pack. We're starting off with Kevin Durant, base. DeAndre Ayton, base. Chris Middleton, base. We have a Drew Holiday, Astro. And then we're ending it with a Moses Moody, Rookie Revolution. Nice. All right. That is going to do it. So let's just get some of these base cards out of here, which honestly, in they, these are really nice base cards for sure. Um, let's just bring into frame some of the more notable cards. Man, Evan Mobley, two Evan Mobleys. We have a Cade Cunningham, a Jalen Green, Wow. Bones Highland, Charles Bassey, Jeremiah Robinson Neal round out our rookies. We have the autograph of Trey Mann right here. And then just some really, really cool parallels in this supernova of LeBron James. This vortex of Kyrie Irving this Chris Paul. I mean, there's another rookie there. Christian Wood. That is a really, that's a really cool card. And it's numbered. You know what? I didn't even see that. Numbered to 75. So this is a number parallel of Christian Wood. Nice. Drew Holiday. And then a groove of Carmelo Anthony. All right, there you have it. That's the 2021-2022 Panini Revolution basketball uh, blaster box, I believe. That is not a hobby box. This looks to be just a typical blaster box. So what do you guys think? Tell me what you thought about this product. I, I actually like it. Uh, this is a little different than what I've been pulling in the past few videos, but uh, I really like this look. I really like the the different parallels. I like learning about a uh, new product. So I'm a fan already and I got some pretty cool pulls. So I hope you enjoyed the video. Thank you for stopping by, checking this out. And again, on your way out, if you haven't done so, please drop a like, subscribe, click the notification icon because it really, really does mean a lot to me. 
And with that being said, Chavez is out.